have no idea how I'm going to film this video. <laughs> There's actually another one. There's actually a fourth one. I don't know how. Ooh, I hope none of my information is anywhere here. I'll just do it this way. That thumbnail was not easy. I'm so happy I have some boba. Ooh. I have three boxes. I have two more on the way, but I'm not waiting anymore. I want to smell. I should probably finish this first, huh? This is watermelon boba. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel, guys. Thank you so much for clicking this video. I just went through the struggle. Christmas time, winter time is my time to shine. The cold weather comes out and I come out. It is the best time for me. I love it. And when I saw Bath & Body Works drop their first Christmas collection, I bought everything, you guys. I bought the entire store. I bought every single thing. <sighs> I don't know where I'm gonna put it all. I have no idea. I'm planning on decluttering. I had told myself I wasn't gonna per I wasn't gonna do any big shopping until the next semi annual sale, which is in December. But I couldn't resist this collection. I couldn't resist Christmas. I couldn't resist these scents. They're very like cookies and sugar cookies and mints and I couldn't resist the holidays. So I bought everything. I simply bought everything. R right now I have three boxes with me. I couldn't wait till I got the rest of the boxes. I believe I have two more boxes coming. So I just want to get this out the way. I want to show you, I want to smell everything. I have not smelled anything. I've been waiting for these boxes to come. I only opened one of the boxes so far because I want to make a really quick TikTok. I have not smelled a thing and I am dying. So let me shut up and let me get into this video because I'm really excited about this video. Oh, by the way, the candle I'm burning is Goose Creek in the Butter Banana in the Cake Pops collection. Mm, it smells so good. My entire room smells like this delicious butter cake. I don't even know how that makes sense because butter like mm, but it smells so good. It smells so good. But yeah. So if you guys enjoy this go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more Bath and Body Works related products and hygiene and all that good stuff. But let me just get into this video. This one is my first one that I already opened and again I have not smelled anything. I'm so excited to try this out. By the way leave a comment down below what you guys are excited to try. Are you guys going to try any of these scents? Are you going to buy any of them? Let me know. It is Christmas time even though it's not even Halloween. I think tomorrow is Halloween. But it doesn't matter. It's Christmas. I'm going to randomly pick them up and smell them for you guys. The first one up is Joy and this is in Sugared Snickerdoodle. Oh the packaging. The packaging they did so good with this love peace and joy line they did really good usually i never look at the scent notes before i smell them but i already saw it snickerdoodle spice creamy vanilla sugared musk i do notice it's it's not filled to the top which i don't care personally but it is not filled to the top line it does look like it's been sprayed around but it's totally fine oh, oh let's see what If you love cookies, if you love bakery, if you love snickerdoodles, I smell the vanilla. Oh, this is this is really gourmand. It is very cake or cookie, very sugary, very bakery. It smells like an oven. Well, not literally. It smells like you just opened up an oven and you took out fresh baked snickerdoodles. Oh, this is really I can Oh, this smells so good. If you don't like bakery scents, you're not going to like it. It's very much a cookie, bakery, sugary, warm type of smell. So, oh, I love it. I'm kind of picking up, what is that, the snickerdoodle, like a cinnamon, which I'm not a fan of cinnamon, but if it's fine in this because it's a snickerdoodle. Oh, this smells great. Oh, it's a, a snickerdoodle spice. So, yeah, I'm picking up cinnamon, but it is, if you like gourmand, if you like cookies, this is the one. Next up is Peace, and this is an Iced Raspberry Bellini. I didn't really care for this one or the peach one. I just picked it up just because of the collection, and it's cute. So let's see. What was this again? Iced Raspberry Bellini. Oh, very, yeah. So this kind of reminds me of those summer, summer sprays we had, which was, what was it, like Raspberry Tangerine? It kind of reminds me of that. Really raspberry definitely fruity what is it so it's chilled prosecco okay sparkling raspberry and citrus twist yes it's it is citrus 
So this is very like a compilation of fruits. Like you smell oranges in here, you smell raspberries. It's a very fruity smell. By the way, I realized my channel name is very airy and I've been conscious about the fact that I use the word very so much when describing scents. So I'm gonna try not to use very. Or if you see edits, that means I edit, edited myself out of saying very. Love, which is cotton candy champagne. There, oh, I was about to say it again. Excited to try this one. It is, oh, I keep reading it when I'm not supposed to. It is bubbly rose, sweet strawberry, and pink sugar. I heard it's very, see, that is not, to, like, like they used to be filled to the brim. I heard that these are more strawberry focused, which, okay. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Interesting enough, I was most excited for this. Well, no, I was excited for this snickerdoodle too. I was very excited for the cotton candy champagne. It reminds me of the strawberry fizz. It reminds me of the strawberry fizz body spray that just came out recently. And I don't know. I was I was super excited about this one, but I don't know. I feel like we've had this scent before. It smells like the strawberry oh st soda, strawberry soda. It's very, I guess, sweet. There is a perfume that people keep comparing it to with a pink bottle with like the striper or whatever. It's like a candy perfume. It does smell like that one. The bubbly rose is very prominent in here. You can definitely smell the bubbly, the champagne, and strawberries. Um, I was most excited for this, but it's it smells good, but I think it didn't live up to my expectations of it. So it doesn't smell bad, it's just not what I expected. It's very cotton candy champagne. I don't know what I was expecting, but it is very strawberry forward. Next one is Hope in Winter Peach Marshmallow. I don't think I'm gonna like this. I rarely ever like any of their peach scents. I'm not a fan of Bath & Body Works peach scents. I don't know what it is. It always smells like throw up to me or like just doo-doo. I don't like it, so. Again, I just bought this for collection purposes because it was so adorable. Yo, it is going less and less. Whoa. So let me get this straight, Bath & Body Works. Y'all are raising the prices on us, giving us less coupons, filling up the bottle less. Like Y'all are being stingy with the sprays now, and they kind of smell more watered down. I've noticed the scents in the past used to be way stronger. They're kind of more watered down now. Like. The lasting power, I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like the lasting power on them have gone down as well. But they always get us, don't they? Let me stop rambling. I'm trying to avoid smelling this, but let's just go for it. They definitely skimping. Like, I know y'all see that. They're just skimping. These used to be filled to the brim. Oh, it doesn't smell like throw up. That's not bad. Mention, I'm not a fan of their peach smells, but the fact that this doesn't smell bad, I actually kind of like it. So it is velvet peach, vanilla meringue, and creamy jasmine. I don't smell the jasmine. I think it's the vanilla that's saving me from like this smell. It's actually pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. I, there's no marshmallow in here. I don't know where they went with pink. It says winter peach marshmallow. No marshmallow. It just smells like peach peach and vanilla maybe okay it's not bad not bad for a peach smell came with no cap oh lord look at that they are skimping it is christmas cookies oh what can i spray it on i guess i'm spraying it on myself let's see okay it smells just like last year's it smells just like last year's. If you smelled Christmas cookie last year, it smells the same to me. I just finished a shower gel literally last week, so scent is very fresh in my memory. It smells just like last year's. It is creamy cookie dough, almond biscotti, caramel woods. It's You smell all three of them. To me, I personally smell all three of them. It smells really good. Again, if you like bakery scents, if you like cookies, it is very much a cookie scent. Very bakery, very gourmand. And I'm still saying the word very goodness up is the vanilla bean noel i've heard it's not as good as the years previous so let me see i don't smell it like i'm smelling alcohol but guys i'm not smelling anything i'm not 
It is fresh vanilla beans, sugar cookies, warm caramel, whipped cream, snow kissed musk. I know what it's supposed to smell like. I don't smell anything. I told y'all, those they're skimping on us. They're giving us less product. They're raising the prices and they're not even putting the freaking oils in here. I don't smell it. I'm gonna put this aside and I'm gonna come back to it. Ooh, I'm excited for this one. This is Gingham Heart of Gold. I do love the original Gingham, so I'm excited to try this one. I don't know what changed. I didn't look at the fragrance notes because I wanted to be surprised. But as I mentioned, I love the original Gingham. Let's see. Oh, ooh. Oh, interesting. What is that? It smells fresher. Gingham is already a very clean, fresh, I would say a balanced sweet and floral scent what is that oh it smells sweeter something smells sweeter in here it smells like a sweeter gingham i don't know how what did they add in here oh apple they oh, okay so it's crisp golden apple creamy vanilla and warm sandalwood oh this smells great oh this smells great i'm gonna pick up all the body care in this if you like the original gingham, I think you'll like this. It smells like a sweeter version of the original gingham. That apple scent, if you like apple in here. Oh, oh, this, oh, Lord. I'm picking up more of this. This this is definitely going into my, I want to smell like this right now list. I already filmed the Project Use It Up, and I'm a little mad because now I want to replace all of my Project Use It Up and put it with this new collection, and this is definitely go... Well, I don't want this to be a Project Use It Up. I just want to use it every day. Like, does that make sense? Like, I don't want to finish it, but whatever. Next up is Sleigh Rides and Snuggles. No idea what this is supposed to smell like. Oh, Okay. Off the bat, I'm getting a tree vibe, like the Christmas, what's it called? Oh, pine or balsam or something like that. It's a very, there is an earthy smell in here. Some type of, like, it's that Christmas tree smell, the pine or balsam, whatever it is, whatever it's called. I definitely, and then it's sweet. Snow kiss icicles, oh, fluffy balsam and vanilla bourbon. Yeah, if you like those winter smells with like the trees and pines and stuff, this is definitely that smell. But it's not that bad. I actually don't like those smells at all. I never get those candles, but this doesn't smell that bad. It's actually kind of sweet. The vanilla bourbon is definitely like prominent in here. So it's not, don't think of it as just a Christmas tree. It's actually pretty sweet. It's not bad actually. The more I smell it, the more I like it. But you definitely pick up, what is that, the balsam? You definitely pick up the balsam in here. Oh, that's not bad. Not bad. Next up is Fireside Flurry. I wonder if it's going to be like Bonfire Bash, which I don't think it should be. But again, I haven't looked at the scent notes. Oh, oh, there's like a cashmere. Like, what is that? Amber cashmere or something? Like, there's a very, there's a warm kind of milky scent in here. What is that? It reminds me of other... Oh, what is that? It's like a, not a musk, but like a cashmere, like the sens sensual amber cashmere musk. Like, what is that? Oh, and it's sweet. Oh, it's sweet too. What is this? This is delicious. Toasted marshmallow, pink lavender, cashmere woods. Okay, I don't smell the lavender. I definitely pick up the toasted marshmallow. It has that sweet scent and cashmere woods. Oh, I like this one. Definitely pick up the sweet and the woods. Ooh, y'all, it's getting less and less. Y'all see that? I'm on to y'all. I'm on to you, Bath and Body Works. Ooh, this smells good. Oh, I'm super excited about this one. This smells super good. So, Gingham and this one are probably going to go on my list to like start using immediately because it smells really good. What is this? Tea Tree and Peppermint Aromatherapy uh, Lotion. I, I'm going to be honest with you. I got this for the packaging. I don't really use their aromatherapy line, but look at this packaging. It was so adorable. I had to pick this up. Got this one. Had to pick up a fairy tale in, what is this? Is this a glow lotion? Yeah, a glow lotion. Y'all, this is $19.50. So when it was on the $5.95 sale, I immediately snagged this up. I love the smell of fairy tale. Body butters are expensive. So when they go on sale for $5.95, absolutely. Ooh. 
Yep. So it looks like that. I do see the little sparklings in it, so I'm very excited to use this up. Very excited to pick this up for $5.95 also. Couple, they're not in this box, but I know I did. A, a aromatherapy Orange and Ginger Shower Steamers. I was so excited for these shower steamers. I haven't seen them before. So excited to pick them up. I do use shower steamers, so I was happy about it. Oh, they're individually packaged. I think there's six of them or something in here. So cool, cool. Picked up the Honey Wildflower Roller Ball fragrance oil super excited about this one because i love honey wildflower and it was 5.95 the original is 19.50 for this sucker so the fact that i picked up for 5.95 super excited about that i open it yeah it's just a roller ball you just 24 hour moisture in the fireside flurries smells good it's already yellow by the way a lot of people do ask about the yellow. It doesn't mean it's gone bad. A lot of times when there's vanilla in a scent, I have noticed it does go yellow faster. Sometimes they just come yellow. So yellow does not mean it's gone bad, okay? It smells good, it smells like the spray, but I think a little more toned down. Christmas cookies in the body moisture. Yep, it smells just like the spray. Cotton candy champagne. Oh. I think I like this better than the spray. It's a little more sweeter. It smells more like frosting. Oh, I like this one way more than the spray. I could smell the cotton candy more in here than the, the spray. The spray smelled more like champagne and strawberries. But the body lotion smells sweeter to me. Oh, I like the body lotion. Of course, I had to pick up the sugar snickerdoodle. I picked up the whole set. I love it. I cannot wait to start using this. It smells just like the spray. The body lotion and sugar snickerdoodle. There's a wrap on it. I'm sure it smells the same. The love cotton candy champagne in the shower gel. And the love cotton candy champagne in the body lotion. First box done. As I quickly remembered. Let me see if I can smell vanilla bean Noel now. I don't smell one thing. I might have to return Vanilla Bean Noel. I don't smell anything. Box up. I haven't opened this one, but as you can see, this flap came open. So I don't know what it is. Almost, I would say 90% of my Bath & Body Works boxes come open. And I've always taken pictures of them. I think what happens is the male people, they carry it from this flap and they just open it. Luckily, most of my things have never been stolen or anything. The box is just open. I, I mean, I don't appreciate it, but I get it. Like, it's if it's easier for them to hold it like that, it's cool. It's whatever. As long as they're not dropping my stuff. But a lot of my boxes do come open. Oh, Lord. I have so much more to smell. Box two. Let me go quicker because I feel like we've been here for a minute. Oh, my God. So many more sprays. Okay, let me just start picking them out. Fresh sparkling snow. I'm, I'm sure this is going to smell very clean. I'm thinking. Let's see. Hmm, there's fruit. Is it citrus or a fruit? I'm smelling a fruit in here, like a melon. Maybe like, not a watermelon. What am I smelling? This is good. Fresh sparkling snow. This is good. I smell like a melon or a watermelon or some type of sweet fruit. And then there's like a cream, like a cashmere, not a cashmere, but like a perfume almost in there. What the heck is this? Iced pear, okay, frozen melon, okay, it is melon. Winter apple, snowdrop blossom, and frosted musk. Oh, musk. Yeah, this is good. Fresh sparkling snow. This is a very fruity musk smell. So the melons, the pear, the apple, and the musk. I was not expecting that, but I really enjoy this one. That smells really good. Okay, fresh sparkling snow. We're off to a great start. And I never got a chance to smell pure wonder, so I'm excited to try pure wonder. Let's see. I know a lot of people have been loving it. Let's see. I don't even know what to expect. I'm assuming it's going to be like a perfumey smell. Oh, it's soft. Oh, it's very girly. It's like a powdery, like, soft smell. Is that, what is that? Is that floral? I think it's a floral scent. I'm not sure what, uh, the packaging gorgeous, by the way, but I'm not sure what I'm picking up. I do smell, I think it's a floral Okay, so that's Pure Wonder. Okay, so if you're a floral fan, you'll love Pure Wonder. It's a very like soft, 
good smell. It smells good. Twister Peppermint Classic. I know what this is going to smell like, but hopefully they haven't changed it. Ah, this instantly opened up my nose. Mm, smells like peppermint. Smells like candy canes. Smells like Christmas. It's sweet. It's minty. Oh, my nostrils are open. It is... Cool peppermint, sugared snow, vanilla buttercream, and fresh fresh balsam. I don't pick up the fresh balsam, luckily. I didn't know there was actually vanilla buttercream in this. To me, it's just straight sweet candy canes, like sweet peppermint. Oh, I love twisted peppermint. Winter candy apple. Let's see. Oh, yep, it smells like classic winter candy apple. Um, just you know i don't know how to describe it. it just smells like apples it's sweet apples it is candied red apple winter rose petals candied orange maple leaf fresh cinnamon orange cinnamon i don't think i've ever read the uh, notes on this it smells good it's very classic winter candy apple love it oh i forgot i picked this up so i have a shimmer fizz body lotion in the winter candy apple i still have this one from last year and uh the Vanilla Bean Noel, so it's a little fizzy, fizzy lotion. Next up is the Vanilla Bean Noel body cream. Interestingly enough, I can smell it in the body cream, but I cannot smell in the spray. It smells good. It smells like classic Vanilla Bean Noel. Again, another shower steamer. This is in the Eucalyptus Mint one. No, Eucalyptus Spearmint. Vanilla Bean Noel in the Body Lotion. Again, I picked up all the sets in this. Vanilla Bean Noel in the Shower Gel. Iced Raspberry Bellini in the Body Lotion. Winter Candy Apple in the Body Lotion. Twisted Peppermint in the Shower Gel. Oh yes, I'm so happy I picked this up. Gingham Heart of Gold, Gold in the Body Lotion. I'm so happy I picked that up. Twisted Peppermint in the Cream. Fireside Flurries in the lotion. I'm so happy I picked that up. Winter Candy Apple in the body cream. Winter Candy Apple in the... Oh, I had another spray hiding in the bottom. This is Twinkling Midnight Sky. What are you? Oh, berries. It smells like fruit. Oh, this kind of smells like perfume. Oh, wait, this might be my favorite. Almost, almost favorite. There's been a lot of good ones. Oh, I love this. What is this? There's like a vanilla and like a fruit, but not like a summer fruit, but like a nighttime fruit. Almost like a pomegranate, but what the heck is this? Twinkling Midnight Sky is Midnight Flower Sparkling Vanilla Ice Blackberry. Ooh. This smells really, really good. Oh, this smells really, really good. I don't know, this just went up on my list. I'm gonna pick up the entire body care line for this because I was not expecting to like this and I love it. Oh, it's like a sweet, dark perfume. Oh, that smells so, y'all, don't sleep on this. I'm actually gonna watch videos to see if people are liking this smell because I fell in love with this smell. Twinkling Midnight Sky. I will say it does smell like something we've had previously, but with a twist on it. Oh, I love this one. A Pure Wonder Exfoliating Glow Scrub and a Winter Peach Marshmallow Scrub. Again, I when I originally purchased this, I didn't think I was gonna like the Winter Peach smell. However, I always pick up scrubs because they are expensive. So when they are on sale, I just pick them up because they are so easy to use. I go through scrubs like crazy. So even if I don't like the smell, it's fine because it's not going to last that long anyway. But I always pick up scrubs. Ooh. Yeah, it's not a bad smell at all. The peach, uh, marshmallow peach smell, it smells pretty good. I'm surprised I like it. I'm glad I like it. Y'all, my head is still on Twinkling Midnight Sky. That smells so good. So finished box number two. Let me go ahead and get the third box. Okay, last box that's been, that showed up at my door. Still waiting on box number four. I think and five. I remember this box. I bought a bunch of like lip. I didn't order that. I did not order that. Hold on. Okay, so this is what this box looks like. 
I know for a fact I did not order this because I just decluttered into the night because I don't like the smell of it into the night. So I definitely didn't order this. They must have accidentally thrown it in here. So thank you so much, Bath and Body Works. Into the Night. I'll probably end up giving this one away because I don't like Into the Night. So I have a free Into the Night shower gel. Thank you, Bath and Body Twisted Peppermint Lip Gloss. I love lip balms. I have, if you think I have a big candle collection, body care collection, hygiene, whatever the case may be, my lip balm, my chapstick, it's, but however, I have a good reasoning because my lip balm is my support thing. Like it keeps my anxiety down and I go through lip balm like crazy. So I love lip balm. Lip balm, oh, if there's ever, anytime anyone wants to get me anything, I'm just like lip balm. Just, I love lip balm. Um, so I had to pick up the Twisted Peppermint and the Hot Cocoa and Cream. I had to pick these up. Hold on. There is more. Picked up the Lip Oil. Oh, by the way, there is shine in here. I didn't realize there was little glitter flakes. Peppermint Patty. Frosted Icing. And I picked up the Lip Oil in the color. What color is this? Candy Pink fire bash in the what is this a lotion or just regular oh yeah so it's just a whipped body butter again these are expensive so uh, when they go on sale always pick up body butters because these are expensive what is it $18.50 these are expensive so $5.95 smells delicious cotton candy champagne diamond glow what is this called diamond shimmer mist I thought I would like this more that's why I picked it up in the diamond however it's still cool more of the shower steamers I picked up lavender and vanilla another orange and ginger and eucalyptus and spearmint so i got more of these another shampoo in gingham i really enjoy this so i picked up another one and i also ended up getting a thousand wishes in the shampoo i hope you guys enjoyed my christmas haul i can't believe they already put out their christmas collection in october like there's still halloween there's still thanksgiving but we already have all our christmas stuff so i'm excited to see what else they drop on their second part of their holiday um launch I'm just, I need to stop shopping because I did a lot of damages, y'all. Imagine, I ordered five boxes. Sucker was not cheap, I'll tell you that. And I also have the Christmas candles, and I don't know, I'm excited. I love this time of year. I don't know, I'm just excited to see what else they drop. I'm gonna probably pick up a couple more things from that drop, and then after I'm done shopping till um, semi-annual sale, which is what, like two months away, which is nothing. But yeah, I'm super excited. Friends, let me know down below what you guys are picking up from this collection, what you guys like, what you guys don't like. Please, please, please let me know. I would love to hear your thoughts on it. Go ahead and subscribe to this channel. Thumbs it up. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.